Hello, my name is Mitch Huey, and I just wanted to take some time to talk about a great graphic novel called Rorschach. Uh, it's written by Tim King, and the art is by George Flornays and Dave Stewart. Backstory. Uh, Rorschach is a character from The Watchmen, and The Watchmen is a DC series originally from 1986 and 1987. Uh, depicts an alternate history in which superheroes emerge in the United States in the 1940s and 60s, and their presence changed historical events so that the United States ultimately won the Vietnam War and the Watergate scandal was never exposed. Um, this series has been a huge commercial and critical success, um, and there have been a lot of subsequent books, TV shows, and movies. So Rorschach is the DC character. He's part of the Watchmen series. Uh, the, while, while the Watchmen series focuses on a cast of superheroes, Rorschach is the main protagonist. He drives most of the plot forward and serves as the series narrator. Uh, in the world of the Watchmen, most of the superheroes are employed by different governments around the world, um, but Rorschach acts as a non-government affiliated superhero. Um, he's, he's a vigilante. He acts on his own code of justice on any criminal that he can find. In this most recent graphic novel titled Rorschach, uh, published in 2021, it takes place 35 years after the death of the original Rorschach. It follows the events of a unknown detective um, following the crime of a new Rorschach named Will Meyerson. The graphic novel focuses on the United States and the contemporary time period. Most of the original heroes from the first series are either dead or in hiding. In 1985, a giant space squid was unleashed in New York, killing thousands. Uh, the original superheroes were unable to stop them, and afterwards, most lost their belief in the power and the benevolency of superheroes. I'm a huge fan of the illustrations and the graphic art that's included in this novel. Uh, it's got a classic Dark Knight feel, like 1990s Frank Miller style. It's got a dark urban motif and a realism, a grittiness that, that draws you in. It definitely matches the original uh, Watchmen style. The writing in this graphic novel is excellent. The story by Tom King and, and Dave Gibbons is very creative. It's a dual narrative that takes place concurrently. Um, one narrative is in present time, and it's following the police detective, and the other follows the criminals in the years and months and weeks and leading up to the crime. The reader is aware of which story narrative is which by the color choices that they used. Um, each different color identifies which narrative, and sometimes the colors switch throughout the throughout the graphic novel. Sometimes there's shades of the same color kind of shown here, or sometimes in black and white, and then the other narrative is in color. I hope you go out and read this graphic novel. I really recommend it. It was a lot of fun. It's very much of a who's done it. Um, the suspense really draws you in. The art is great. Um, and it really kind of picks up with this classic series of The Watchmen. So if you're a fan of The Watchmen, I think you'd really enjoy this too. Thank you.